On any given day within the SAF, thousands of NS men train hard amid moving tons of steel, bullets, munitions and other explosives. Why do our NS men do it? They do it to protect Singapore. Because without NS men, we cannot have an SAF or the home team that can deter terrorists from attacking Changi Airport or Jurong or harming innocent civilians in shopping malls and crowded places. Without the SM NS men and the SAF, Potential aggressors will not shy away from simply marching into and occupying today's affluent Singapore as Iraq did to Kuwait. Without a strong defence, our air and shipping routes in and out of Singapore could easily be blocked as Qatar now faces. These are not imaginary security threats that our NS men train for, but real. They have happened elsewhere and can occur to Singapore too. We must never give up on national service that forms the backbone of our SCF for national defence. This imperative of national service and our national defence does not absolve or reduce the accountability of MINDEF and SAF, way, or SAF in any way to ensure safe training. On the contrary, it compels MINDEF and the SAF to do all that is humanly possible to prevent training deaths for NS men because precious sons have been entrusted to us by their families. MINDEF and the SAF will hold ourselves accountable for every single Ennisman entrusted to us. I am deeply sorry for the loss of four precious Ennismen in the last 17 months. The NSF will strengthen, the SAF will strengthen its safety systems. Even as we honour those who died in service of our country, we must soldier on to build a strong defence to protect Singapore and to protect every NSMN during training.